Hey everyone, welcome back to another Dr. Twisted's Custom Figure Time. This time it is the Christmas edition. Since next week is Christmas, I probably won't be doing a video. And if I do, it'll probably be a Christmas haul video. But, uh, we'll have to wait to see about that. But this is my... We did this probably two years ago. We took my daughter to one of those little like clay deals to make Christmas trees and this is the one I made me in my typical Dr. Twisted fashion I had to make my tree a monster so I'm instead of bulbs I made eyeballs all over the place and then I gave him a big bloody mouth with a tongue sticking out of it I guess the paint didn't get that very back spot there. So you can see a speckle of white. I'll probably just take some paint and paint that. I gave him a little, gave him a little like a tree tendrils and horns. A couple little arms and a tongue. And then you turn it around the back here. And he's got a little... Kind of looks like Mr. Bill. Oh no, it's Mr. Bill! Like wrapped up in here, ready to eat him for later. He's already got a mouth full of guts. So this was a lot of fun. You know, my wife and daughter made a big Christmas tree, but I had to make a like a smaller, just monster one. So I mean. I had to, had to do it my way. I had to have fun with it. And that is my uh, Christmas custom. What do y'all think? I think he's pretty awesome. I think he looked a lot better before the glaze. But it looked a little dull. So this is just like super shiny. And a lot of fun. I mean I was thinking about going... And doing some more custom paint to it to make it like give them like shadows and stuff under the eyes and arms and whatnot add some darker greens in there but I don't know it's one of those things I, I still love it for what it is it was a fun fun memory with the family and that's, that's what it's all about and this is pretty much how you made it you take some clay and make a spiral all the way to the top clay snakes spiral all the way to the top and then you sculpt and add stuff on the front of it and then you paint it and then you leave it with them for a couple weeks i think it took like two weeks and they throw it in the kiln and glaze it and all that kind of stuff but this was a super fun christmas memory and if you have a family, then I think it's a fun little little day out. And it creates a cool memory. And I've have I have this now. I display it all year round because I I dig it. I have it in one of my glass cabinets with some other stuff. But there you go, my friends. Thanks so much for watching. And if I don't see you well, I'm gonna do a couple more videos, but this week. But if I don't see you on Christmas, then hope you all have a happy holidays. Whatever you celebrate, Christmas, Kwanzaa, if you don't celebrate it at all, I just hope you have a great day. And um, until next time, my friends, peace.